Sup y'all, bring you guys another video. So as we all know, or if you didn't know, over the weekend, Chris Eubank Jr. fought against Liam Williams over in the UK. Fight was shown live over in the UK on Sky Sports. And apparently it uh, broke records this fight. Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, um, yeah, it broke records apparently. More than a million people, more than a million views, uh, more than a million eyes tuned in to watch this fight over in the UK. Um, Eubank is a very popular fighter in the UK. After all, he's the son of Eubank Sr., uh, Liam Williams also has a very good following in the UK. It, it was a very good domestic fight and for this fight to do over a million views um, No surprise in my opinion Sky Sports recently tweeted this out Record-breaking over 1 million viewers tune in to watch Eubank Williams um, And to my understanding it's on free Sky Sports TV uh, I guess if you have cable TV and if you have Sky Sports, you, you know, you could have just tuned in and watch it and apparently it did better it surpassed uh, figures uh, that the Joshua versus Cornish had back in 2015 and as well as the Khan versus Vargas had uh, in 2018 and if you click on the link it will lead to this website um, it did a peak audience of 1.05 million views and I think it did uh, an average of ha around half a million that throughout the whole entire event it did an average of uh, 585,000, which uh, surpassed the uh, Joshua versus Cornish fight, and as well as the American versus Samuel Vargas fight. So, so yeah, um, you know, with this new promoter boxer promotions, um, honestly, I still for, somebody said that boxer promotions is being led by the people at MTK Global. Uh, I'm looking at the people working for Boxer Promotions and honestly, I don't recognize them at all. Um, but it seems like they're doing a good job working with Sky Sports. I mean, there's there's a platform that has audience, who has an audience who watches boxing. Matchroom decided to leave Sky Sports and go with The Zone over in the UK. So there's that audience that watches boxing through Sky Sports and you know Eubank and I'm sure a lot of fighters will take advantage of that viewership Savannah Marshall will be fighting in an event we have the Amir Khan versus Cal Brook fight going to be on Sky Sports box office pay-per-view in the UK um, yeah for it's it, to me Sky Sports seems like it's still the platform the network for growth in the UK the zone you need to pay for it's an additional subscription and you know you're paying for it on a monthly basis or for a whole year it's a choice when it comes to sky sports to my understanding not only boxing will they they also show other sports right over in the uk not just boxing so it's like i guess it's the espn of the uk that's the way i look at it but you know i'm glad it said it did great numbers you know, I always want boxing to be successful, whether no matter where it happens, whether it's in the UK, US, Canada, Europe, no matter where in Europe, you know, Russia, Asia, I want boxing to be successful everywhere. So I'm happy that this event did more than a million views. Um, and, you know, I, I wish Sky Sports nothing but success when it comes to the sport of boxing. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.